good morning students today we will discuss inline function inline function it is a part of your function overloading what is function overloading two or more functions having the same name to perform different operations but differ in number of arguments are called function overloading in the function overloading we discussed definition syntax and one lab program as an example and advantages and restrictions among this one of the question is going to be formed it may be function overloading definition with a syntax and example or it may be a function overloading definition with the advantages or need or restrictions okay so now another concept will this that is your chapter number 8 chapter number 8 inline function within that only this is the second part that is inline function what is inline function please recollect your first year knowledge just i am writing the code here so within the void main you are invoking a function do you remember this yes this is called this is called function call this is nothing but function call so here we are writing the function int and int x comma int y so here we are performing an operation written x plus y i am not writing the complete one so this is called as function definition function definition when the function is invoked control transfer from calling function to called function calling function to called function called function will perform the operation once the task is completed control will back where exactly the function is invoked isn't it but in inline if we add in front of this it is a inline in line then this entire code will be replaced here but this should be defined first in the C, in the first year program call will be somewhere else and we are writing a definition somewhere else but in in line function this particular code whatever it was there this should be written after the function definition after the function definition that means here we need to invoke the function call once the program starts its execution whatever the function call is there control will never move from the calling function to call the function instead of this this entire code here will be replaced who will do this job your compiler will do the job not by you just you are mentioning a definition of the function with the inline keyword inline keyword such that that inline function code will be replaced in the function call itself by the compiler by the compiler that means your function call over x will not be there ill in the ill a control transfer agudu transfer once the task completed from here to control will back to the call function will not be there that means it avoids function call over x it avoids function call over x did you got the students what is that a function what we are going to invoke that is a function call that function call itself will replace the function definition by the compiler automatically by the compiler automatically it avoids the call overheads but what is the characteristics of this your definition of the inline should be defined before the function call before the function call so here your function call should not be there after the definition of the inline your function call should come you got the student 
that is a first characteristic and inline function is declared or defined with the inline keyword inline keyword and it is a short functions it will not be effective for complex programs complex programs did you got the students what are the features of your uh, inline function inline functions are very compact functions compact functions and compiler replaces the function call within the body of the function wherever the function call will be there in that place the entire definition of the fun inline function will be replaced by the compiler automatically when it gets invoke when it gets invoke and it is a very small function it executes very faster very faster but we need to take a few characteristics that means your definition of the inline should be defined before the function call inline function should be defined before the function call and inline function is defined with a keyword called inline it is a keyword it is a keyword did you got it understood and your inline function will run little faster than your normal function why because there is no call overheads ili na ili control transfer agudu transfer agudu ili na ili transfer agu time duration it will not take that is called call overheads it avoids function call overheads did you understood inline functions are short functions inline functions are short functions compiler replaces a function call within the body of the function within the body of the function by seeing this we'll write the syntax of this yes your syntax followed by yes inline keyword what is this inline is a keyword inline is a keyword that is definition or general syntax of inline inline is a keyword what is int yes it is a written type specifier written type specifier what is this add add is a function name add is a function name and within the parameter within the parenthesis we are writing the arguments and write the body of the inline body of the in line did you got the students yes this itself you can write it as an example but a simple lab program is there for you we'll discuss that lab program okay students before that once again what is in line function in line functions are short functions in line functions are short functions your compiler will replace the compiler replaces the function call within the body of the function within the body of the function what is the syntax of the inline inline functions defined with the keyword inline and compulsory written type specifier see do you remember this is you are defining inside the class syntax yes the same syntax just add the keyword first as a prefix the keyword in line your uh, function is syntax is ready here same the syntax of your what defining a member function inside the class same syntax just we prefix it with a keyword in line and do you remember this is your um, function uh, overloading yes i have been written termination here function 1 argument 1 argument 2 yes same syntax wherever the function the word is there written type specifier function name parenthesis if it is a inline add the prefixed word as inline if it is a friend add the function friend but friend will not contain the body that is terminated by semicolon the function overloading just without that same function name that's the name of the function is same for two or more functions did you got the students yes 
written your inline written type specifier function name arguments within the flower brace body of the inline statement inline statement before going to the lab program we will discuss first what are the advantages of your inline function as i told it is a small function it executes very faster inline functions uh, are compact functions it executes very faster size of the object core is considerably reduced size of the object core object core dot c p p this is your original file then once you execute your program will be converted into object file that is your once you press the alt f9 your object code will be executed uh, created then once you press run uh, this is your exe file will be executed this you are creating the file that is called as source code once the source code was completed we are doing what compilation that compilation what code we are going to generate while compiling your object code will be generated this object code size will be considerably reduced in inline function once the compilation done we are doing next stage is called as run in the run execution code will be generated executable code will be generated this will gives you output this will gives you the format of the program this will convert that format of the program into the machine readable format then that will be executed by your processor that means your machine code size that is your object code of this inline functions are considerably reduced code will be executed very faster efficient code will be generated efficient code will be generated and readability of the program is increased readability of the program is increased and the first advantage and it is a very very important advantage it avoids function call overheads it avoids function call overheads the first one it is a compact functions inline functions are compact functions it executes very faster object code considerably size of the object code is considerably reduced and uh, program if it execute it uh, generates the efficient code it increases the readability of the program and it avoids the function call overheads five points you need to write okay students so what is the disadvantage the disadvantage what i wrote here here i wrote add function right in this place whatever i have written the inline function entire code will be replaced here inside the object code this code also will be there this code also will be there the execution file size will be increased what size executable file exe file size will be executed fast whatever the lines you have been written the entire lines once again get replaced here internally code will be it uh, takes more size the size of the code internally gets increased so that executable file takes more size in the inline function that is a main disadvantage it requires more memory to store the executable files executable file only one disadvantage is that that means your uh, object code size will be reduced executable file will be increased the size of the executable file is increased so internal memory requires more to store the inline functions to store the inline functions then inline functions are not suitable for complex programs it is not suitable for 
complex program hence the name itself was the link it is related only for short functions related only for short functions did you got the students we'll continue friends here i have written completely the related information for your inline so inline definition inline functions are short function compiler replaces the function call within the body of the function then what are the main characteristics of this characteristics definition of the inline should be defined before the function call inline functions are defined with the keyword inline keyword inline what is the syntax of that inline written type specifier function name argument within the body we need to write the body of the inline function okay so inline functions are small functions it executes very faster it is not suitable for complex programs these are the characteristics of your inline function what are the advantages and disadvantages these are advantages inline functions are compact function calls compact function calls the size of the object code is considerably reduced efficient code will be generated the speed of the pro execution program will be increased it avoids function call overheads and it readability of the program will be improve increased efficient code will be generated speed and considerably reduced object code size will be considerably reduced minimum five points you need to write and what is the disadvantage the size of the executable file is increased so that internally it stores it takes more memory to store the exe file and inline functions are not suitable for complex programs okay so the lab program write a program to find the cube of a number cube of a number any number we need to find the cube of that how we can write that particular number multiplied 3 times you will get the cube of that otherwise it a mathematical function if you want you can write power of n comma 3 so both can be used so i have used a normal function so instead of using a math dot h so two address files we required here hash include io stream dot h then hash include conio dot h conio dot h here i have taken one class name called assign so i am assigning the value whatever here we have written this is called as next chapter code that is constructor you will come to know in the next class so just with the class name the class name and the constructor name both are same you will come to know immediately next chapter it is so just i have taken the value whatever we will give through the object that will be copied here that value we are assigning to the variable n just you remember that that just accepted value we are storing into the n i i have given the function code declaration here and i have been defined the inline function outside the class inline function i have been defined outside the class with the keyword inline written type is a int class name and your um, yes inline function so just so before the uh, how to define the member function outside the class return type specifier class name member uh, identity label that is scope resolution operator function name in front of that what i have been added yes inline i have been added inline i have been added just the code whatever the n value you take now suppose if the n value is 2 2 into 2 into 2 2 into 2 into 2 Two two is a four. Four two is a eight. You need to get the output as eight for the cube of two. So how it will execute? Program control will come to the main function. So it will accept one value in the n and giving n as two. N as two. 
that n value I am assigning into the object. That 2 will be copied into the object. We are invoking the value along with the function. What is that function? Q. See here, I have been defined the inline function before the function call. This is your function call. This is your function call. When the control comes here, control will not move from here to here. Entire this code will be replaced here by the compiler. This entire code will be replaced by the compiler in the function call itself. Function call itself, your compiler will execute this particular code in the function call. Then immediately it will display cube of 2 equal to 8. Cube of 2 is equal to 8. Did you got the students? So only this much it was there in your inline function. One class is enough to prepare completely 5 marks. That means here also two different possible questions. What is inline or what is inline function? Syntax and advantages. Otherwise, what is inline function? Explain with a programming example. Please remember for inline syntax is compulsory. It's a very very important whatever the question it may be from the inline. Please write the syntax of the inline function. The syntax of the inline function is very very important to get a complete marks in the inline question. Okay. Here also two different possibilities. What is inline? Advantages and disadvantages. This will give you fun marks. Otherwise, what is inline? Syntax and example. This gives you fun marks. And this will also help you for lab program. Once you prepare this program, it will help for both theory as well as practicals. Did you got the students? Did you understood? Yes. This finishes your inline functions. What are all we discussed today? What is inline? Characteristics of inline, advantages of the inline, disadvantages of the inline, syntax of the inline and a lab program of the inline function to find the cube of a given number using inline function. Okay students, so I am going to give one more uh, video for you for explanation of your programs. Okay, thank you students.